Namaste. In this video, we will be calculating the value of an integral by using Monte Carlo, a SARK method that I have discussed in previous video. Okay, the process and how to do this we have discussed in previous video. So let us calculate the value of an integral by using a SARK method of a Monte Carlo. Okay, so this is a given integral, and by process we have to suppose. Let us consider y is equals to x square. That is f x yes is equals to y or y equals to f x. So we calculate the upper and lower boundary for y. So when x is equals to two, then y is two power two is four. <coughs> Similarly, when x equals to four, okay, y is equals to four square. It is 16. So the limit for y is 4 and 16. So it becomes like as this. Okay. Since y equals to x square, it is a parabola. So, so the lower limit of x is 2. So it goes like this 2. Okay. So x equals to 2 line is this. Lower limit of sorry upper limit of x is 4. So let us suppose it is 4. So Again, again it goes like this okay and so when x is 2 this point y is 4 okay so this point is 2 4 this point is 4 4 when x is 4 it is 16 y is 16 so this point is 4 16 and let us draw a rectangle here so this is the area of cup or integral which we have to find and let us consider this rectangle okay so it can be written as like this okay so this is 2 4 and this is 4 okay 4 4 it is 4 4 and it is 4 16 okay it is 2 16 so we have to find the area of this part and this is the outside the boundary region so our boundary equations becomes like this x lies between a and b yes which i have expressed in previous video yes in srk method so a is 2 and b is 4 Similarly, y lies between f of a and f of b. So, f of a is 4 and f of b is 16. So, y lies between 4 and 16. Okay. And area of rectangle is given as, okay, area of rectangle is given as, a is equals to what was the formula it was b minus a into f of b minus f of a so it is 4 minus 2 into 16 minus 4 so it is 2 into 12 is equal to 24 square unit Okay, now, so since we have suppose y equals to x square, so the boundary equation becomes y is minus x square is less than equals to 0. If it is less than equals to 0, if true, if true, then in, yes, else, out. Okay. And let us consider a table, okay? So, like this S of Sn, X, Y, and the condition is X, Y minus, sorry, Y minus X square and remark, okay? <coughs> so, X is between 2 and 4. Yes, 
y is between 4 and 16 that means a and b f of f of a and f of b so it is the equation we have to solve okay now let us write the equation in table so let us suppose a is equals to y minus x square okay and x is calculated as so x is equals to so random number between 2 and 4 is calculated okay so saved ran 4 minus 2 is 2 yes plus lower limit is 2 so 2 okay random number is calculated as like this and second y is calculated as y is equals to 16 minus 4 is 12 so saved ran 12 okay plus lower limit is 4 okay this is how we calculate the random number between 4 and 16 okay so let us calculate so initially let us put the value of x and y at 0 okay since 0 lies beyond this so we do not take it okay let us take next point so first random number between 2 and 4 is 3.544 second it is 15.568 okay so it gives the value as 3.008 since it is positive it is outside the region okay so similarly we calculate next value random number okay 2 it is 2.788 y as 14.08 <coughs> okay it is 6.307 so it is also positive so it is also outside the region similarly 3 okay so y is 5.908 and x is 2.75 and it is calculated as minus 1.65 so since it is negative it is inside the region similarly 4 okay i'll be writing this 12.5 2 minus 2.0364 it is also in okay 9.856 2.904 so it is positive 1.4227 okay it is outside the region so okay six point so thirteen point six two four three point six four eight okay it is zero point three one six zero so it is also outside since it is positive okay seven okay so y is 9.196 x is 3.772 it is minus 5.031 it is inside since it is negative okay so let us go to 8 iteration y is 9 sorry 13.33 2.62 okay 64 it was so it is 6.45 so it is also outside the region okay 9 iteration so it is 7.648 2.522 it is 1.28 okay 7 so it is also outside the region now 10 iteration okay 
y is 15.46 x is 3.912 and it is 0 0.156 so it is also outside the region okay i have taken up to only 10 to 10 random number okay so it is better if we take up to 20 or 15 so for this video i have take up to only 10 random number so total number of random number we have generated n is equals to 10 yes and number of point inside the region okay what is the value of number of point inside the region one two three okay three number are inside the region so we can use the formula area of curve okay in previous video i have explained it okay area of curve or area of integral integral is equals to area of rectangle into n by n so area of rectangle what was it area of rectangle okay let us see it was 24 square unit so 24 into total number of points inside the region is 3 okay n is 10 so what is the value of it okay 24 into 3 divided by 10 it is 7.2 yes 7.2 so let us calculate the actual value okay 224 x square dx okay so 224 it was x square yes so it is eighteen point six six yes so error okay let us calculate error error is equals to eighteen point six six minus seven point two divided by eighteen point six six is equals to okay 18.66 minus 7.2 is divided by 18.66 so it is 0 0.61 okay it is 61 percent error so the error will be minimized if we take okay up to 20 or 15 number of iteration or 15 random number generation so in this way we have found the value of the integral by using srk method of the monte carlo simulation thank you and bye bye